Hi everyone, hope you're doing well. This tutorial is made for those people who are currently visiting the UAE and want to know their exact visa expiry date. That means their last date in the country. Right, so let's get started. Open your internet browser, search in UAE tourist visa validity. Okay, and come down a bit. Over here you will see u.ae which is a UAE authorized website. So click here, move down a bit, over here under check visa validity, you can see this first link, go for it, excuse me, okay, now here you'll see two boxes, in the first box you don't have to do any changes except over here, in select the type of visa, all you have to do is choose visa, okay. In file type box, you will have two options where you will be able to search for your visa. So the first option is Emirates Unified Number, which is also in your visa page, which always make sure you ha carry your visa page. So in order to search for your visa expiry date. So over here, you see this UID number, okay, you choose, I mean, choose it, I mean, copy it, go paste it over here, select the nationality mentioned in the visa, then uh, date of birth, hang on, let's enter that, okay, choose the box and select and put, I mean, uh, hit search, alright, so here's the information you, for your visa, right, so here you will see your file expiry date, which is your last date in the country, over here it's much more clear, last date of leaving this country is 26 June 20, 2023 so this is your last date in this country now always make sure and this is a tip from a travel professional I've been in in this industry since last 16 years so always try to make sure you leave the country at least two days before this date at least two days before I'll tell you why uh, I have worked at the airport as well so I have seen cases where the passenger had uh, was on his last date okay and what happened was the flight got cancelled right now, I used to work for an airline and that particular flight got cancelled and this person had no option other than paying the fine for the next day because uh, he told that uh, his visa is expired and he can't leave the country because of this flight uh, so he was trying to blame the airline but it's not airlines fault basically not even immigration's fault so immigration will not listen to this excuse that you know your flight got cancelled so you will have to pay the fine and leave the country if you're leaving the country if you're extending the visa so that's that's a different scenario so always make sure you leave the country at least one or two days before the earlier the better because uh, god forbid anything happens flight gets cancelled you will be in trouble so that's all from my side today uh, please let me know if you have any questions in the description and please like share and subscribe this is my first video so i hope you like it thank you have a nice day ahead also guys if you have any doubts do mention it in the comment section uh, i am a travel professional i'll mention my details in the description if you need any kind of help you can get in touch through emails whatsapp or mobile number up to you um, and last but not the least please like share and subscribe our channel um, and really thank you for your time see you soon take care bye